Go. I've not got it on slow mo. <laughs> I'm not got it on Steve mode. <laughs> You've not got it on picture. You've got it on video, have you? This on video. You yeah. actually put it on the right setting. Well, I don't know. It's what well, it was on. <laughs> yeah. You ready? I'm ready. Yeah, yeah I've been ready for ages. Yeah, been ready for you. You did it. Yeah. Right, Bailey. Bailey, big long Bailey. Bailey approach 740 SE. What's the SE for, Kev? Don't know. Special edition. <laughs> ah, right. right. So, I don't know. It just goes, doesn't you, you it? Yes, that. Yeah. Well, I would have thought so. Um, this is a 2013 seven and a half metres long. Now, 2013, was that when Bailey started to make motorhomes? Pretty 99% certain that was the first year they brought them out there. So it's probably, this is probably one of the first motorhomes that Bailey did. Yeah. This could have been the first motorhome they did. It could, yeah. You never know. No. And That's it's... why it's the SE. Ah, special edition. Mm. It was the only edition at the time. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, right. Cool. Technical bit. So, what? One tells you there underneath approach. Water. No, uh, no. Underneath the word approach. Alutech. Body, body shell. shell. What does that mean, Jason? It means it's got a body shell made of Alutech. No wood. Hasn't got a wooden frame. No, it's Alutech. Hmm. What do you mean? So, what does that mean? Makes it lighter. And. Shouldn't rot. And it's also on an Alco chassis, which again makes it lighter. Mm. It's three and a half thousand kilograms. Exactly. I mean, a van that size that you can drive on without a C1. Okay. That's well, got a big fridge. <laughs> <laughs> Have you finished with the technical? Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm just, uh, See where this review's going, can't well, we? I've just been very observant. It's. Uh, <laughs> Let's have an observant day. Um, good size awning. Four and a half metres, would you say? Well, yeah, F45. 4.5, but they're all F45s. <laughs> you numpsy. <laughs> they've all got F45. A um, little bit different, so we fill up the fresh water with a pump. Yeah. Uh, so the pump goes into there, and then you fill it up. I don't know why they do them. Well, I can see why they do them. They do because when you're on a campsite, you haven't got to move your van and everything. They do because basically they put a caravan on a chassis because it's the first one they made. They were only making caravans before. So they didn't have much practice, did they? Yeah. yeah. Okay. It doesn't look like a caravan, does it? Have a look at it. It is a caravan. No, it's a motor caravan. Yeah. Anyway, can we get on? Yeah, come on. Okie dokie. Yeah. So, storage. Yeah. Storage? Do we know what the layout's going to be? I do. How do you know? Because I've been in it. <laughs> we have a leisure battery. Hook up outside aerial. Yeah. Yeah, you like that? Um, why would he? Do you want to jump at this side and I'll go on the other side? Mm. Now, this is on the old shape. Yeah. Faceless Pump. wall. Faceless. Yeah. yeah. I think it was it's just after... HDI 130 brake horsepower as well, Kevin. Yeah. I think it was just after this that they changed the later shape, didn't they? The new shape? Yeah. I think it was 15. No, I think it might be some 14s. Nah. I might be wrong. You are wrong. Yeah, I'm never wrong there. Okie dokie, so we have lines going across. We also have them on the um, passenger side. I don't really know why they make motorhomes without the blinds, do you? Keep the cost down. Yeah, I know. If they do an entry level or something like that. It just keeps costing. Oh, I don't know. Um, reversing camera, steering wheel, we have cruise control, six speed, blown air, and we also have aircon. Aircon, there you go. Little media pack there, that's quite a little cute media pack, isn't it? Just for a 2013. Yeah, I think the screen's smaller, isn't it, on this one? What do you think? Yeah, I think, I think that might have been an extra, you know, because I don't think that would be standard. Might be wrong. Um, nice seats. Yeah, nice upholstery. Yeah. Nice carpets. Nice carpets. Um, pretty st it's standard Peugeot. Yeah. The carpets were actually brand new. They were still in the uh, in the locker. They'd never been put down. No USBs yet. I don't think USBs were then in 2013, were they? Yeah, it would be. No, I don't mean fitted on bands and things oh, no, like no, that. No. So, um, much as much as. So, meet me around the other side, Kev, and we'll crack on with the outside of the van. 
electric mirrors and electric windows. And it's the HCI 130. I said that. Yeah, I so, said that when I got in the bus. so what does that mean? It's been uprated. Be a belt, not a chain. Oh no, belt, not a chain. Belt. Mm. Um, Good job I'm on the belt. Gas locky? Yep. Two sectors you get in there. Yep. Stop being nosy. Separate flush tank for the toilet. Yep, and there's the cassette toilet mm. as well. Put the caravan. Motor caravan. We've got a storage no, box. Nice big back storage box, right? Let's put the bike rack and then we also have the reversing camera above. Mm -hmm. Yep. Just underneath there, see the point? And we've and got a spare wheel. Spare wheel? Spare wheel. Comes handy. Yeah. Doesn't have to get a puncture. Would you like to swap the wheel on one of these? No. Would you really like to swap? Would them? anybody? No. Spe especially with the jack they provide. Because the jack's just through a van. You're not you gonna lift, wouldn't, would you? You're not going to lift three and a half ton with a scissors jack. Let me just um, do something. See if it works. Now we've got a dead leisure back, haven't we? Okay. Mm -hmm. No problem. That's a shame. Shall we run a hookup in it? Can do. Better yeah. the lights on. Yep. Jace, just before you go in, what sort of price are we looking at for this? I'd say 38 40, yeah. 40,000, 38 40,000. 38 40, yeah, it's low mileage, it's been well looked after. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I think you've got it right there. Happy with that? Yeah, carry on. All right, come on. We'll get some lights on, Kev. Get some lights on. Cut oh. Where do you want to start? Yeah, start at the front. Yeah, it was on light duties, you, right? Hey? We'll start at the front there. So, right. Yeah. So we've got both seats swivel. Yeah. Oh, it's a seat part there, Kev. Not just to take seat off it. And then we've got dinette, which will make up into it's a lounge. It's a, it's a front lounge, it's not a dinette. Alright, oh, it's a front lounge then. That pulls out. Oh. There you go, you've got a single bed. Yeah. It's got to be a double though, hasn't it? Yeah, the others pull out, look. Let's have a look. Yeah, pulls out. Oh. Pulls out. Make a nice big double. That will make a nice big double, won't it? So it's a four berth, two belts. Four berth, two belts? Yeah, we must remember that if you want to take the grandkids away. Just put them two in there, Kev. You can't. You've also got a single bed, well no you haven't got a single bed have you? Because, oh you could, turn the cushion around. Turn the cushion sideways on you. Yeah, mm. makes a single bed. You might as well make the double up really haven't you? Yeah. To be honest. Ooh. So, a lot of storage all the way around. Loads of storage, yeah. I like the little um... Mm. TV area wasn't that one Jess? TV aerial. TV aerial booster. I'm seeing it there. Come on, little spotlight. There you go. Got purple curtains. Purple curtains with purple cushions. Purple cushions. A little bit of purple inset in there as well. Yeah. Um, nice lounge. Yeah. Nice Spa lounge. Spacious lounge, isn't it? It's very spacious. Just um yes for you, yes, to give you a proper idea. Do a few stats while we're at it. It's only done 15,000 miles, 2013. Um, we mentioned three and a half thousand. Uh, what payload? Uh, 450. Oh, 458. Oh, oh, there you are. Yeah, see, because you're three and a half tons, so you wouldn't have a a big payload with the length of the van, would you? Yeah, but well, you're still wrong. Eight uh, kilo. I was wrong about eight kilo. You're still wrong. It's two bags of spuds. <laughs> uh, fresh water. Fresh water, 120. 100. Waste? 90. 100. It's usually less, isn't it, the waste for some reason? Yeah, it normally is. Um, fly screens, blinds. Now, I do, I do like this area. Yeah. It's a nice area. I mean, if I go back here towards uh, the back of the van, I mean, you're a long way away there, Jace. Aren't you? I suppose so. Very roomy, yeah. Any yeah. points is? 
It's a big van. What is some not? Just... Plenty of room. Right, let's move on to the dinette area. Dinette area, the kitchen area. Kitchen. Whoa, look at the size of that sink. I can have a bath in that. Look at that, eh? <laughs> My mum used to bath me in the sink when I was little. <laughs> Did you have mum? I think so, yeah. I think we all got bathed in the sink, didn't we? Yeah. It's perfectly honest. Well, she pots at the same time. <laughs> she washed you in a saucepan, didn't she? <laughs> and she dry off the microwave. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't have microwaves with our bar. No. They were invented. They didn't have cold tellies when you were born, did they? No. Right. So didn't we even got... have a telly. <laughs> Can we carry on? on. So we've got the... the... Cupboards there, lockers, yeah. and then we're moving into a different, more of a kitcheny type of feel, isn't it? Yeah, really? we've got like a glass, glass finish there. Come on, that. There. Nice. Same as again, I'll just open that up there. And then we get in a couple of power points. Um, now, this is a difficult one, right? Because you've got your sink there, you've got your four beer hob. Yeah. Yeah. But then, then you've got your prep area here. It's a bit. Yeah. I think it'd have been better with a sink over there. But then you'd have had to reach. Then you'd have had to reach over. Um, it'd have been nice with a workshop that would drop into the sink, like a chopping board, something like that. Or a little bit like the orchard trails where they come out. Yeah. Make it take a bit more. And, I don't really think there's an awful lot you can do here. No. No. Do you? Yeah, I've got this, this option here. You've got a bit of workspace there. I've got that for you. Yeah, too. Um, and again, it's, 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 it's you, know, you drop that down, it's workable, isn't it? Yeah. To be honest with you, but um, it'd only be two of you anyway. Would you need to have the sink this big? No. Could you put it down a bit? Yeah. Or even. Will that be plenty there? Put the sink that way around. That's a good shout. Sink there. Yeah. Basically. So, what I'm liking is look at these big drawers. Well, look, soft clothes. Again, plenty of cool, I guess. Thank you, eh? <laughs> Didn't like being shoplifters, I bet. I've got security tags on them, have they? There's a good size. Yeah. Oh, well, there's your bath. Yeah, yeah there's your bath. Yeah. Hey, that's a, that'd fit in there, that, and you've got a draining board there as well. Mm. Well, there's what you were talking about, isn't it? Oh, I can't get it out. Yeah, that's your draining board, yeah. That would probably drop in your sink, wouldn't it? Well, drop onto the road, wouldn't it? We'll get them right at some point, shouldn't we? Yeah, there you go. And then it Got goes on there, there as well. Yeah. Put it back in there, Kev. Oh, would put it in the wrong way, wouldn't it? on it for 2013 though, isn't it? It's been looked after, hasn't it? No marks at all. No. Nothing at all. So we're getting um, grill oven, separate grill, separate oven yep. on there. And then we'll move over to the side. Move the keys out of the way. We've got the Truma system, heating up water, blown air, gas, electric. Yep. And then again, obviously this is where the tell is going to live. Yep. Another little cupboard there. Oh, that's what we've got here, Kevin. We've got a 4G router. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's posh. Isn't it? And then we've you got... Could, you could put your tally over bracket there, couldn't you? And still maintain a bit of a workspace. Then. You could do. Mm, I would. Microwave. Mi we weren't invented when I was though. Microwave. <laughs> oh, you <do>. and, then, <laughs> and then we've got good size. Good size freezer. Yeah. Fridge, good yeah. size. Yeah. We've got a little um, cupboard in there. And we've that got bit, the one underneath. That bit of beer cupboard, that. Is that your beer cupboard? Yeah. And then it's fitted with an extractor fan. So, oh, hey, hey, this is a heated one. Uh -huh. A heated extractor fan. Can I won't heat extract, it'll heat and blow in. <laughs> well, you don't want to be. You don't want to warm the birds in the sky. <laughs> <laughs> um, place for the freestanding table. <laughs> and then obviously we have the fixed bed at the back. Which is a French bed. French bed? That is what's known as a French bed. French bed? Don't know why, because the French always have a bed with a corner cut off. Um. Must do, must do. Must do. Again, we're getting the natural. That nice, nice cushion. Nice, aren't it? Nice yeah. little cushion. Looks very boutique, doesn't it? Yeah. A bit girly. <laughs> <laughs> well, you like the cushion. Again, cupboards all the way around, skylight above. Um, 
decent size. And what we do have as well, I like that, the separation, you've got it, it gives you that bit of privacy, doesn't it? Sticks on the magnet. It's not sticking, Kevin. I thought you, oh, were, trying to, thought you were trying to play it like a bloody accordion. <laughs> No, I was trying to stick it. Well, it does, it does stick in the end. Yeah. And we'll drop that down there. So, again, comes around. We have, what we have added, that's why we've got a TV there as well. Yeah. And then if you just look above, there's your TV aerial. Um, and then let's, oh, look at this. Ooh. Wardrobe. Big wardrobe. What's that in the box, is it? It's a um, Ferguson TV. That looks of it. Okay. That's the one out of the bedroom, then. There you go. Fine. And then we'll just have a nose in there. Oh. No, I do like that. Look at that. This is the one thing I like about these are nice separate shower. Look at that. That's a nice washroom that is. Yeah. Really is. You've got your cassette toilet. Ample sink there. Quite a stylish little sink actually. It, it is, it is. And then storage okay. below. But here you go. More storage there. Good storage there. Well that's a nice washroom. Yeah. You've broke it, haven't you? <laughs> look. There you go. I haven't broke it, it's you that breaks. So just have a look in there. That's a really nice washroom. Good washroom. It is a good washroom. Swivel washer. toilet, so it's sort of like the way for access to the shower. Nice, good, good size shower. It isn't it? Yeah. So we've got um, a four berth, which is really a two berth, haven't we? Um, yeah, because you've, you've only got the two belts. Yeah, who's this going to suit? Uh, it suit a couple. Uh, you could take the grandkids as long as somebody brought them to meet them there, but uh, yeah, yeah, you could accommodate the grandkids as well on the double bed in the front. Yeah, you can. Um, this is a nice van. Yeah. This is not, this is this is a, a van you can spend a lot of time in. Again, light wood for 2013. Mm. Got na nice and light, not, yeah. not got the dark wood. But would you agree you could spend a lot of time in this van? Yeah. Go away for a few months? Oh, easily. Yeah. yeah. Hey. I, uh, the good thing about it is I like the separation. We've got the dinette over there, um, we've got the kitchen area separate, we've got the bed area, we've got a great washroom, which I really do like the washroom. There should be a lot of storage under that bed, I think. I, think that might, have a look, eh? I wonder if it lifts up, same as the. Uh, there you yeah, go. There you go, that it can be accessed from outside. There's your water heater. Water heater. Combi, there. Yep. combi um, you've got the pump there, there's the awning winder, and then. And that's your waist there. See, so. that's something you wouldn't get in an end lounge. You wouldn't get that amount of storage. Because you've got the fixed bed, you'd get, you'd get your chairs and all that in there. Yeah, good storage there as well, isn't there? And we have oh. got the storage box on the back as well. We've got storage everywhere in this. Yeah, yeah. What's your thoughts? Nice, I like it. It, it is. Yeah. It is nice, fine. Nice and roomy. It feels homely as well. Hmm. And everything else. So, yeah, Bailey 740 SE on the LU Tac. Tell you tech. Yeah. Um, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, subscribe to us, like, do all that kind of thing. Yeah. And yeah. Yeah, should we go find something else? Yeah, let's go find something else.